And now, an important message from the president of the South Jersey School of Jaywalking. Lots of people jaywalk. People have been doing it probably since, uh, maybe since the dawn of time, I don't know. But while lots of people jaywalk, there's only a small handful of us that are actually good at uh, jaywalking. Uh, to me, mostly that's people from New Jersey, New York, and Philadelphia. We're the best at it. Now, you see, a lot of times down here I see people jaywalking. They just walk out in the traffic without even looking and they almost get hit. That's not smart. The goal of jaywalking is to save time. The goal of jaywalking isn't to cause fatalities or car crashes. If you cause fatalities, that's a loss of life. If you cause a car crash without a loss of life, insurance premiums are going up. Either way, someone's getting fucked. And if you want to get fucked, do that at home in the privacy of your own home or down there at one of them, uh, you know, clubs where you can go fuck in front of other people. I guess they're out there. I don't know. But <laughs> the point is, me, when I jaywalk, I look like, okay, that car's far enough away I can safely make it. Because, like, let's say you're here and there's an intersection down there with a light and then there's an intersection back that way with a light. You don't want to walk all the way down to the light this way or that way. It's wasting time. You can go right this way. But you want to do it safely. Now, I don't advocate jaywalking. And if anyone is watching this and they go out and they do and they go jaywalking, you do that of your own free will. And I am not responsible in any way for what happens. Now, with all the legal bullshit out of the way, jaywalk smartly. Make sure you got enough time. Make sure it's safe. The goal is to get from point A to point B or point Z without a detour at the hospital. Because then you didn't get where you're going. Then you're sitting in a hospital for who knows how many days piling up medical bills. Now, do you really want to be sitting in a hospital piling up medical bills? I don't think so. I've been in a hospital a few times. Not for jaywalking. Eye surgery. It's not fun. Jaywalking? I'm the best. Now, I could say my shit doesn't stink as far as jaywalking, but I'm not going to claim my shit don't stink. Uh, my shit does stink. I'm proud of that. I got an air freshener hanging in the bathroom. Now, if you must jaywalk, pretend you're from New Jersey or New York or Philadelphia and do it with some sense. Otherwise, don't do it. As I said, you're going to cause accidents, fatalities, insurance rates to go up. Who needs that kind of hassle? Not me. Now, mind you, I don't uh, drive. I, I'm legally blind in one eye, so you forget about that. So anyway, we all know jaywalking is illegal, and if you go out there and do it, you do it of your own free will, and I accept no responsibility for the consequences. However, if you must do it, do it with style. And remember, I am the president of the South Jersey School of Jaywalking. Does the South Jersey School of Jaywalking actually exist? Yes, it does. Every time I cross the fucking street and I'm jaywalking, that's it existing. So if you're out there and you see me jaywalking, pay attention. Hey, that guy knows how to do it. And then you too could maybe become a master jaywalker. Um, however, as I said, I'm pretty much convinced that uh, only certain parts of the Northeast are good at jaywalking. And uh, you might think, hey, you're an arrogant prick. Whatever, but I know I'm the man as far as my jaywalking.